Well, hello everyone, my name is Reginald. Slice and Dice is sadly unavailable this week, as he's just jumped on the Thunderhawk and is off visiting his auntie on the moon of Davin. She's not too well, you see. Nurgle plague. Qu quite nasty. She's got a head growing out of her head. So, he's let me out from the cupboard underneath the stairs to help him out and cover for him. So, I thought today we could answer some of your emails and your comments. I should also say that we're going to use pseudonyms for the emails so that you, the lovely viewers, can remain anonymous. And so, with the help of me and my glamorous assistant, Wilma, give a wave, Wilma. Wave the camera, Wilma. I can't. He's a blooming idiot, says Wilma. Um, so, let's get started. It's quite, quite bright today, Wilma. Can I get my sunglasses? Thank you. Thank you, Wilma. These are blooming 3D glasses, you're blooming idiots, Wilma. You're blooming idiots. So, as my chiropractor says, let's get cracking. <laughs> and Mrs. Trellis from Terra writes, Dear Slice and Dice, thank you for your first video. It really helped me get talking about my hobby. Well, that's wonderful news, that really is. I like to think that some people who poke fun at us gamers are really just closet gamers themselves. And that's, that's a shame, you know, but, but you've got to embrace it. Come out of the toilet, so to speak. Porky Mix Porky writes... I already think that your series is pure epic awesomeness. I will think about some Warhammer related things for you to talk about, and if I find them, I will tell you. Well, please do, Gorky, because being of very limited intellect and education, Slice and Dice runs out of ideas very, very quickly. So, um, if you've got an idea, please swing it his way. Um, ha! Tony Boney says... Just watch Gamer and Proud. I must say that it's truly inspirational stuff. I got myself to tell my girlfriend about the hobby, and I showed her my orc army, and she thinks it's really awesome. Next step is persuading her to give me a game. Ah yes, gaming with the missus. I used to do that. But she beat me. And I ate her. <laughs> Eduardo Cobblepot says... This entire video was just you talking about things and random pictures. Most boring thing I ever watched. Well that is a shame, Eduardo. A slice and dice really isn't for everyone. But really, was it more boring than this? Maxine Maximus asks... Seriously, have you never won? Well, unfortunately, yes. Slice and Dice was born with a very strange D6 allergy, which means he can't go 24 inches near a dice. And if he does, his face will literally melt off. So he often has to get his enemies to roll the dice for him. And for some reason, he always fails his armor saves. No idea why. Wilma. Wilma, have you seen the cat anywhere, Wilma? Iridad Iridescu comments... We have nothing to fear but Conrad Cruz. He is fear incarnate. Ah yes, I think you might be right. I used to know Conrad, actually. Ah, I do miss Conrad. He's all performing at the Royal Ballet, doing a version of the Nutcracker. Although this time they're calling it the Nightcracker. I do miss Conrad. Auntie Pandy writes... Nice accent, we from? Well, that's a very good question. We hail from the lovely land of Scotland, but uh, it's, it's a bit sort of dull. Uh, it's very brown. The sea is brown. The sky is brown. The land is brown. Even the people are strangely brown. Like, my cameraman, Wilma, is very strangely brown. He's also got a strange flakiness to his skin, which uh, makes for a very nice omelette, actually. Yes. The possessed demon god, Virilus the Fourteenth, writes... What is a Womble? A Womble? 
A Womble is a very strange creature that lives underground, overground, wombling free. The Wombles of Wimbledon call and are we making a joke of the things that we find? I got something in my teeth. Feel like I've got something in my teeth. Gryffindor Mackenzie asks. Slicing dice, speed It's over 9,000 power points. Awesome! Well, I have no idea what you're talking about, but it sounds lovely. <laughs> Detective R. J. Beethoven writes. Their Tao video was Tao Riffic? <laughs> Very good, Beethoven. Very good. Well, there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Don't worry, Slice and Dice will be back next week with a real show. It's back into the cupboard under the stairs for me. I'm having a rattling sniper for lunch. And a Garzman for pudding. Until next time, cheerio. Cheerio. Bye bye. Bye bye. Wilma, Wilma, give me the camera, Wilma. You can't just... Wilma, come back, Wilma.